Hi everyone, how's it going today? I'm sorry, but I have to switch the narrator again. This is really beyond my control. I hope you won't have to wait too long for things to go back to normal. It's always a pleasure to have you with me on my channel. As usual, I will discuss some topics that you like. I understand that the quality of this video might not be the best, but I hope that the content is still understandable and informative. If you're interested in learning more, I also have a Telegram channel where I share various information that I can't post here, and make sure to subscribe to my backup YouTube channel in case of unforeseen events. So, without further ado, fasten your pants and let's get started. The discovery of the man-made block at the bottom of the Mediterranean Sea has left historians and archaeologists puzzled as it challenges the conventional wisdom about the capabilities of ancient humans. The fact that the monolith is estimated to be more than 9,000 years old, according to the time the island sank into the ocean, is also significant as it pushes back the timeline of human civilization in the region. The monolith, which is 13 meters long and weighs 15 tons, is made of a type of stone that is not found in the surrounding area, suggesting that it was transported from a distance. The block also has man-made holes that go through the entire structure, which is a remarkable feat of engineering for a society that was thought to be hunter-gatherers. The discovery of the monolith has caused a stir among historians and archaeologists, who are now re-evaluating their understanding of ancient human civilization in the region. Some have suggested that the monolith may have been used for religious or ceremonial purposes, while others believe it may have served as a navigational marker for ancient seafarers. Regardless of its purpose, the discovery of the monolith highlights the ingenuity and resourcefulness of ancient humans. It is a reminder that our ancestors were capable of feats that were previously thought to be beyond their abilities. As researchers continue to study the monolith, they hope to gain a better understanding of the ancient civilization that created it. They will also be looking for other evidence of advanced technology and engineering in the region, in the hopes of piecing together a more accurate picture of human civilization in the ancient Mediterranean. The discovery of the monolith has also sparked the interest of the general public, who are fascinated by the idea of ancient civilizations that may have been more advanced than previously thought. The monolith has become a popular tourist attraction, with visitors from all over the world coming to see the enigmatic structure for themselves. Let's hope that nothing is hidden from the discovery. What do you think? Sedona, Arizona is a place of natural beauty, with its red rock formations and scenic hiking trails drawing in visitors from all over the world. But there is another side to Sedona, a metaphysical side that is shrouded in mystery and legend. One of the most intriguing places in Sedona is the Bradshaw Ranch, which is located deep within the National Forest. The ranch was once a working cattle ranch, but it is now off-limits to the public and is said to be guarded by the U.S. government due to its connection to interdimensional portals. According to local lore, the Bradshaw Ranch is a place of extraordinary phenomena, with sightings of everything from the Arizona Bigfoot to otherworldly beings reported by visitors and locals alike. Some have even claimed to have had encounters with extraterrestrial life forms in the area. Despite its reputation, the Bradshaw Ranch remains shrouded in mystery. The U.S. government has never officially confirmed its connection to interdimensional portals, and there are few concrete details about what actually goes on there. However, for those who are willing to venture into the National Forest at dusk, there are tour operators who will take you to the edge of the Bradshaw Ranch and allow you to observe the strange phenomena that allegedly take place there. Many of these sightings occurred during the last hour of twilight, when the light is fading and the veil between worlds is said to be thinnest. What do you think? There have been numerous cases throughout history where governments have taken steps to classify certain sites or discoveries, often leaving people to speculate about what might be hidden behind closed doors. In some cases, 
These classified sites have been connected to military operations or national security concerns. However, there are also cases where seemingly innocuous discoveries have been shrouded in mystery and kept out of the public eye. One such example is the discovery of a small room with a hatch in the floor during the restoration of the Ranganatha Temple in India in 2015. Despite the excitement generated by this discovery, the Indian government quickly moved to seal the room and forbid any further exploration. This has led to speculation among enthusiasts and researchers about what could be hidden inside, with some calling for the government to make the discovery public. But this tendency to classify discoveries and sites is not unique to India. Governments around the world have been known to keep certain sites and discoveries under wraps, leading to speculation and intrigue among those who seek to uncover the truth. What do you think? Path Through the Unknown the parasites appear programmed to do their mindless activities without any course correction, just following a script. People who fall in line with the parasites for power, pelf and profit, appear programmed to believe in this fake reality. And then there are the NPCs who try to be good citizens getting triple needled. Controllers of this drama are outside somewhere. The movies like Westworld and 13th Floor show the controllers as very wary of errants and attempt to eliminate those who find out about the simulation. However, in Movie Adjustment Bureau, story by Philip K. Dick, the controllers follow the deviants who veer away from the script till they reach love. The script is then changed to accommodate that. This appears closer to the truth in our world. Those who follow the path of the heart, even in opposition to the parasite script, Find their way through the unknown. What do you think? Now, it's time for me to hear from you. What are your thoughts on this video? If you found it interesting or informative, please consider giving it a thumbs up and sharing it with your friends and family. Remember, the more people know about these important topics, the better. Before we wrap up, I want to extend a huge thank you to all the individuals who dedicated their time and energy to research and gather the information presented in this video. Their efforts are truly commendable and have helped shed light on important topics that affect us all. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications to be notified when the next video is uploaded. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.